And with the total solar eclipse now less than a day away, Taurus are flooding into the path of totality, and that includes here in DFW. A live look out in Dallas, you can see right there, I US 75 is jam packed with uh, drivers. You can see it is just flooded out there on the roadways. There's plenty of traffic, especially during my drive into work today. So experts, they're predicting at least 30%, a 30% jump in traffic through Tuesday. And TxDOT also warning drivers of eclipse related delays. North Texas airports are also staying plenty busy this weekend. Our Don White has more from Love Field. Cousins Tim Sanchez and Marina Ramos flew into Dallas Love Field Airport Sunday morning. We're from Albuquerque, New Mexico, and we came to Dallas for the solar eclipse. The two plan to see Monday's celestial event at a park in Terrell. I kind of planned it out probably like six months before everything happened just because I heard that it was going to be kind of crazy with all the people coming in from all over. I'm excited because it hasn't been, it hasn't happened in a while, so. Excited to be a part of it and to see it. Gregory Nelson also traveled from New Mexico just to see the total solar eclipse. I'm an amateur astronomer, so it'll be actually pretty, pretty fascinating to see. Uh, it's, you know, a rare, a rare event and uh, just looking forward to seeing it. Flyers are encouraged to get to the airport at least 90 minutes early to allow extra time for parking and traffic. A spokesperson for Dallas Love Field says they're preparing for the increase in people traveling here into the airport for the total solar eclipse by increasing staffing and adding additional security. We also caught up with people flying in from Atlanta. I would say probably the majority of the flight was coming here for the solar eclipse staying through Monday uh, to get to experience it. I brought my camera equipment, bought a special filter, and hoping to get my own my own special photo. Many North Texas cities are expecting tens of thousands of visitors as people flock to the area for a once in a lifetime experience. In Dallas, Dawn White, CBS News, Texas.